Hello, everybody. And as promised, we are going to take you through our 1994 Newmar Country Star and show you the inside. Yes, come on in, guys, and watch your step as you enter the coach. As you enter the coach, you'll see that we replaced the carpet everywhere except for underneath the table and underneath the sofa. The table and the sofa are original to the RV. The only thing we did to the sofa was painted it with a dye. The cockpit is original with the original uh, chairs. We changed out the blackout blinds and that's it. We added an entertainment unit. You'll see it's just a reconditioned, repurposed dresser that we put added a fireplace and added a TV on top. Our cabinet work here, we just sanded down the cabinet work, added um, the black, the gray nickel hardware as well as we painted it white. We added a 19 inch television to the top. We stayed consistent throughout the RV with the white and the gray. You'll see it from the front to the back. This is that sofa again that is just a chalk paint. My wife did a wonderful job of dyeing. The floors are a gray plank that we stay with consistent throughout the RV. We go into the kitchen, you'll see the kitchen counters, the countertops, and all we repurpose or recondition that stuff as well. We sanded it down, went white, stayed with the white and the nickel throughout. We added the mood lights. The mood lights were originally added for uh, security purpose and, you know, so that when we're coming in at night, we'll come in and we'll have some lighting. But we like it. We like to set the mood in the RV, if you know what I mean. <laughs> now, if we continue inside of the kitchen, you'll see we stay all original, original sink. The only thing we had to do was um, change out the faucet. We added that little uh, metal part to the bottom piece because it was missing. Uh, but our son, Adam, did a great job of sanding it down and then putting spraying a, um, a lacquer on top of it to keep it from rusting out. We removed a, I think it was a 19 inch television from this spot here and we added our convectional oven. As you can see, ah, I broke the handle, but it's okay. We still use it. We went with the white cabinetry as you continue to see that it's throughout. We left some of the brown trimming in and give it a little bit of um, originality to the RV. We spray painted the stove top as well as we hand brushed the um, refrigeration. The only thing we had to do was change out the microwave. As you take a look, the microwave is a new microwave that we installed ourselves. If we go into the bathroom, you'll see that we did some work in the bathroom. Here's my beautiful wife. Uh, yes, uh, if you see the trimmer of the shower, I spray, paint, uh, spray painted the trim in gray. Uh, we continued with the flooring uh, as in the living room, as my husband described to you guys earlier. And we added some backsplash and a countertop. We did the upper cabinetry white and, and did the uh, hardware, uh, sprayed it nickel, as uh, my husband said about the cabinets in the kitchen oh look at that handsome fella right there woo -hoo, woo -hoo. okay back to the bathroom uh, so as i was saying we did the backsplash we did the cabinetry um overlaid that uh we did the lower cabinetry uh dark gray and did all the hardware where we spray painted that that is the original uh toilet there you guys and we added this uh towel rack and now let's go on into the bedroom. We continue the flooring as we did in the bathroom and the living room, the same plank flooring. Uh, we redid the uh, cabinetries. Now that uh, paint there, we got it from our local home improvement store. Uh, it was one of those oots paint. It has a little bit tint of gray in it. So we went with that. It does look white, but it does have a little tint of gray in it. We did the same with the cabinets uh, as we did. Uh, we kept the same contrast in the, uh, like in the uh, bathroom. We just uh, brought it into the bedroom as well. Uh, same thing with the um, cabinets and the um, window, work. window works. <laughs> and uh, we uh, put curtains up. And you guys see that board behind the bed um, that we got that from our local home improvement store as well. It's just a plank that we put up there. Ooh, ooh, and ooh. we uh, added a 32 inch TV to the back. And that is us, guys, on YouTube. So go out <laughs> and like and subscribe to our page, please. We'll give you this general overview of what we did inside the RV as we lead you guys out. And I hope you like it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it inspired someone 
to get out and start RVing, you can do it also. We believe here at YDI Travel that you deserve it, you guys. Catch y'all on the road.